such a bad lightest. Wait, so the scientist is Ben? He's the target? Yeah. Another shower so good. Right before this, I just watched the Angelon series and watched the movie. I'm on an all-time low right now. I need this to pick me back up. Think of you another shower spot. The teddy bear. Fallen. Is that a good place for you? No, oh, he loves this dog. Oh. Oh! Did he put something in him and that's why he left? Because the best way to carry something is inside of you? Yep. <laughs> yeah, loyal dog meat. So was he not supposed to keep dog meat alive? Is that what it was? The dogs are all supposed to die? <laughs> We've just started, and I, I can already tell this show's got some juice. Of the cottonwood tree, me off forever. Damn. I must say, you never seen a tumbleweed? No, she hasn't. Right to the oh, shh. Thank God that thing doesn't work. <laughs> Let me be by myself. The fan, the oil can, it's all from the. Oh my God. The game Fallout definitely had those moments where you would come across something like that and, or, or you read a story in a computer or something and it just broke your heart. Like people holding each other in a tub, writing goodbyes on notes. The, the dog meat? Oh, rabbit! That's what he was barking at. Before the war, people joked about cockroaches surviving a nuclear blast. You need to go home, miss. Fault dwellers are an endangered species. Mm. I do not think you would be willing to do what it takes to survive. A the fire in his glasses looks so cool. It looks so badass. Who are you? It's pitch black. He saved her life and then gave her a lesson. You went with the tempered lining that helped with mobility? <laughs> he knows about the mods. Me personally, I like the deep pocketed. I want to shoot something. We were assigned to search a town called Philly. We're Philly? Oh. I don't know why he wanted to go drop down there. He must have a reason, though. Graham. <laughs> oh, sh. Death Claw? I mean, it could be a ton of things. I swear to God, if we get a death call in the second episode. Oh, shit. That's where he's at. How did he know? The hell? Fuck. He said fuck. <laughs> he knows. Go see if the target's in there. You got the armor. Move. You're the bait. It's the problem, tip shit. Oh, shit. It's the yo guy, whatever. The bear. That's right. Whoop his ass. <laughs> they don't go down that easy in the game. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Where were you? Is that Michael Rappaport? <laughs> you stupid motherfucker. You know this is all your fault. Oh, sh you know what they do to squires that don't do their job? They hang you, let the vultures come get you. The worst squire there is. This is all your fault. How the f is this his fault? He might leave you to die. It's just like Fallout. It's about choices. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? <coughs> They'll kill you for this. You're honest by bring back the target. He's gonna let him die and then take his armor and then come back with. <laughs> I mean, you were talking too much shit to someone who has their lives in your hands. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> What's that you're working on? Water filter. I just get more sand. Have you tried water? Where the f I'm gonna get water? You head to Philly. Oh, what's Philly? Town. Oh, so they're in Philly. Holy sh. Stay here. Live with me. I'm okay. This could all be yours. <laughs> this could all. <laughs> you good person for not shooting me. Bye. That is another indication of how brutal s is out here. Thanks for not shooting me with the gun. 
he might have put the blade in her boot now. Now that I think about it. If it makes the moon more than just a Damn. <laughs> Man, you don't know what he did. He might deserve to get his ass choked out. You, sir, are a scholar and a gentleman. Mm. You should be commended. You're <laughs> a scholar and a gentleman. I was fucking my chickens. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. The Philly is spelled with an F, not a PH. The boardwalk she was at, though, and where he was at, he was at the observatory. Can we get a map? I mean, why not? It's hundreds of years later. Let's make a new New York. Let's make a new Philly. You know, change the spelling. We've got genuine Stingwing meats. <laughs> yeah, she needs to ditch the vault suit, dirty herself up a little bit. You know, so she could blend in better. This isn't where I think it is. I thought they were at Megaton for a second. Just for a split second, you know. It looks a lot like it, though. Oh, that's probably her dad's pit boy. Oh, look, it's my favorite character. The uh, giddy up horse. Oh man, there's too much stuff in this. You're an actual vault dweller. Vault <laughs> <laughs> oh, You know who she is? She said everyone knows who she is. Everyone knows Vault <laughs> We're going to save America. When exactly were you planning on saving America? And how? Holding the ground for rich folks while the rest of the world burns. All right, and with that type of sentiment, it'd be, it makes sense to, you know, take that shit off. Fuck the vaults. Mm. Thank you for your help, ma'am. That was a smart place for the ghoul to hang out at, because he knows odds are he's going to end up coming to this place. The target. Really think you should go home. No one understands my situation. No one cares. If they took my dad, so? Brought up in a meritocracy. People pride themselves on doing the right thing. Oh, shit. Real zig. Oh, so he must need that thing to keep him from probably going feral. That little empty tube he had and what he was hooked up to in the grave. You know your kind ain't welcome here. I'm gonna make myself welcome. <laughs> yeah. I've been paid a whole lot of caps. Oh, shit! A thousand bottle caps! Whoever kills that fucker! A thousand bottle caps is a lot. Oh, shit! What gun is that? I'd offer you one of these tomatoes, but you got a hole in your neck. <laughs> I want to say it's a hand grenade launcher, but that's something else. Well, the tomatoes. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Look at all those guns. Lock and load. I'm going to have to ask you to leave him alone. Force is justified. Unless you stand down. Fucking ball. Well. <laughs> <laughs> That is a small drop in a very large bucket of drugs. Right. They're all meeting up in the second episode? Fucking awesome. Keep him there until I dealt with a ghoul. Okay. <laughs> that was badass. This mask coming up, and then it goes back. A new foot. Remember when you played your first Fallout game and you saw a Brotherhood of Steel for the first time? You were blown away just like she is right now. Oh sh! Take this man to my client. My client Lee Moldaver. Oh sh! This is where you're gonna find Moldaver. Just, just get to the coordinates. Lucy and Maximus might, you know, like they're feeling each other. You drive that thing like a fucking shopping cart. <laughs> Read the manual. Oh, oh shit. Oh, no. Maybe he heals the dog. Oh, shit.
Okay. Get his new. And now he's running with him? Oh my god. It says here we have about 20 miles left to go. How's your new goal? Why do the, do the Raiders want him? I'm not going to make it. So she's gonna become the courier? Oh my god. Oh, they, they want the thing in his neck. Just taking a cyanide. Tasted like banana. I was surprised it wasn't more popular. <laughs> People don't want to die, man. But how am I going to bring you if you're... Not, not my whole body. Oh, hell no. Please don't say your head. Just my head. Oh, my God. Don't lose your head. Remember the poster? Oh, my God. A ripper? You need to start acting like a surface dweller. Miss McShane. How do you know my name? What the hell? Nah, yeah, he knows what's going on. Hold on, wait a minute. Wait, wait. Does she look like her mom? <sighs> but it'd be the first thing to get her acclimated with how things are up here, you know? Keep your eyes open, Mike. Keep your eyes open, Mike. Okie dokie. Oh my god, they're playing this song. Man, he's directing the episodes. Jonathan Nolan? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. This is exactly what I wanted from a Fallout TV show. Exactly. If I wasn't recording my reaction and had to stretch it out over other stuff, this would have been watched day one, every episode. But I'm going to get the episodes out as quick as I can. Trust me. Man, the ghoul is tough as hell. It's not even just the fact that he's a ghoul. I mean, apparently he was a legend even in the cold open of the first episode where the guy's like, why the hell is he doing kids parties? And we know he has a soft spot. Like, he's not completely just irrational and, and evil he could have killed a lot more people than the ones that were just trying to kill him it looks like he doesn't like being told what to do he is a lone wanderer and he's got dog meat with him makes sense can take a lot of pain even he knew that uh maximus was yeah, that's why he's like how'd you get that suit getting your foot stuck in the paneling little stuff like that apparently he read the manual because he knew exactly which tube to cut he's been doing this for a long time it'd be cool to see how the brotherhood of steel got formate formated too Definitely want some history on that. I mean, maybe we might get a Brotherhood of Steel spinoff show if this really does the numbers like it, it, it should, viewership-wise. Even in Fallout, even in a whole different series decades later, the, who's the target in the show? Oh, well, yeah, yeah. I, I, I don't want to spoil anything in case people want to watch Lost. I don't want to say anything else. Just that character was also getting his ass whooped in Lost, too. I'll just put it that way. <laughs> damn got his head cut off i thought he was gonna be in the show in the show i guess not so many references or and, and just the, the junk that she was coming across in the shop in people's homes feels like fallout makes you want to play the game again seeing the way people feel towards vault dwellers and they're just rich people that were in vaults you didn't really get that feel from the game people were just you know people weren't like hey vault dweller blah 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 because more often than not people that play the game aren't gonna have the the vault suit on there's a whole bunch of other armor and you can even get power armor even if you're not brotherhood of steel you can just throw that shit on but that's going to be a way to easily identify her and it's going to play into people's perception of her so she got to take that off asap and the weapons man we got rippers laser rifles uh 10 millimeter pistols i don't know what the ghoul was carrying but is it a four millimeter hand grenade it might be that uh, or four millimeter grenade launcher it's been a while since i played the game plus i was more of a melee guy you know the ripper the shish kebab you know <laughs> all that stuff from the game but yeah we're off to a rocking and rolling start we got rad roaches dog meat what a treat 